Today we're looking at the M6D AC charger from Toolkit RC. It's a refresh on the old version, and now we have the version 2 and the Pro version, and this is the Pro version. It's a dual charger and will charge all the common batteries available today. Not only that, it has DJI presets built in, so you can charge your DJI drones too. You can charge your phone or laptop at super fast charging speeds using the built-in USB-C, and you can also use it as a power supply, which is a really good option to have. A quick disclaimer, this video is sponsored by Toolkit RC. They did send me the charger for the purpose of this video, but no money has changed hands, and they have had no input or seen the video before it went live. The batteries I'm using are from Boss Lipo, and they were also sent to me for testing. I've been impressed by their quality and performance, and there will be more content coming on these soon. Inside the box, we have the charger itself. We have the power cable for your country. We also have a manual, a QR code card, a screen protector, and a USB lead. For version 2 is going to give you 200 watts of AC power. That's if you plug it into the wall, and the Pro version will give you 300 watts. They're both going to give you up to 800 watts on DC power, for example, if you power it with a battery. The only other difference apart from the price is the Pro version has a wireless charger on top. The full stats are on the screen now. Just pause the video if you want to read them. On the front, we have two XT60 ports and two 2 to 6S balance lead ports. We have venting on the top and the sides and the bottom. On the back of the charger, we have this very large fan. This does only come on when it's needed. We have the DC input connection, which will take seven to 28 volts. We also have a USB-C out. This is a 65 watt charger for your phone, your laptop, etc. And this is where you plug it into the wall. So it's super easy to use. Most of you are gonna have a scroll wheel button on your remote control nowadays. Works exactly the same. Push it to select. Scroll, push it to select. This is a back button or exit button. And it also selects your channels, one and two. So the screen is a 2.8 inch IPS color display, which is viewable in bright light and from an angle. I prefer it in black, so let's show you how to switch it. Press and hold the scroll wheel. We go into the settings, go down to theme style, and switch it to black. At the top, we have the internal voltage. We have the power you're using. We're not using anything because we're not charging at the moment. The USB power, the temperature, and whether the fan's on or off. We also have this LED that comes on when you plug the battery in and it does go up in colour when you're charging. The two channels show the voltage of the battery plugged in, the amps and the individual cell voltages. So charging a battery couldn't be easier. Press the scroll wheel, choose your battery type. We want LiPo. Cells is on auto. You can choose one to six yourself. Mode, we have charge, discharge, storage, and destroy. Destroy is if you want to completely discharge the battery to throw it away, but we want charge. End bulk, 4.2 volts. We have a 1480 mile battery, so we want to charge 1.4 amps. Select your channel, press start, and OK. Also in the menu, I want to show you power supply. This will turn it into a power supply and you can go from one to 28 volts. Also, we have UAV bat. And this is for your DJI drones. We have the Mavic Air. We have all the different DJI drones. So go into the main settings of the charger, press and hold the scroll wheel. There's far too many settings in here for me to go through, but we will explain a couple of important ones. Continuous work, turn this on. If you're charging 10 of these same batteries and you want it to be the same settings, 
just plug the next one in and press start turn this on work completed you can set it to trickle charge when it finishes or just to end there's literally tons of options in here there's so many options on this charger i can't go through everything the video will be three hours long tested the usb and it does a super fast charge well what do we think well i think it's got great features build quality is really good i was quite surprised at that it doesn't feel cheap at all i think if you buy this charger you'll be very happy and i think it will last a long time the v2 is currently around 100 dollars or 75 pounds and the pro is around 130 dollars or 98 pounds all links are in the video description thanks for watching See you on the next one.